MVP leading vote getter for this season's game, 56th NBA All-Star Game. First time it was played in a non-NBA city. So how much longer will Las Vegas be a non-NBA city for? As for LeBron, early on, putting on a show for the fans, the reverse jam. It's a 14-11 game. East down just three. LeBron tries to throw it off the backboard to himself, but slams into Amari Stoudemire. LeBron would stay in the game. He led the East with 28. Vince Carter, nice move. The governor, Arnold, enjoying it. How about Shaq blowing the dunk, but only once. Wouldn't miss it twice. Then a little love for Tracy McGrady. Nothing but love in the NBA. Barkley Bavetta Saturday. Shaq and T-Mac on Sunday. All right, Kobe Bryant, your turn. Here's Kobe blowing by Dwayne Wade. Kobe at 17 to lead all scores at the half. Fourth quarter having fun. Shaq's the point guard. Look at that, going through his legs a few times. What are you going to do now? Pulls up and clank. Carmelo's not hurt. He's enjoying it. 132-106. Here's Kobe, baseline. Can't believe they give up the baseline in the All-Star game. West up by 28. Now, during a break late in the game, Gilbert Arenas joins a line of the flying, dunking Elvises. Oh, boy. Arenas getting it done as well. And uh, even further along, this one was over for a long time, but here it's really over. Kobe, he would go on 31 points, five rebounds, six assists, six steals, and named the MVP of the game. Brian Austin would be third on the all-time steals list in the All-Star game, behind only Michael Jordan and Isaiah Thomas. Bryant, named MVP, joins Allen Iverson and Shaq as active players with multiple All-Star game MVP awards.